and welcome back to Plans on Planning. Here we are planning out our second week of May. I know the time is flying so fast. Like the weeks just come and go and it's crazy how everything is going on. But I'm doing something a little different today and it actually should be fairly easy when it comes to actually planning things out. I got this new um, sticker book. If you take a look at my planner haul video, I'll talk all about it. But the wonderful thing about this sticker book is it kind of does the work for you. Like this is basically a weekly spread all in one page and that's how the whole book is so I thought hey why not give it a try and take the guesswork out of figuring out my weekly spreads because basically it's nicely themed out you know the color scheme is there and I'm like let me give this a try so I'm not going to use this page. I was looking through it and I'm like, I really like this page to do this weekly spreads with. So this is what we're going to be using for my weekly spread for this week. And I'm very interested to see how it goes and how this basically works out. Like, never done this before. I have no idea what the sizing works for because this is a Create 365, my big ideas. And those are more so for the happy planner spreads. And as you can see, I'm not in a happy planner. So I'm like, why not? Just let's do it. Nothing to it but to do it. So let's get it going. Um, I do know that, granted, because you know the sizing is off. But I'm like, if I play around with some things and do some things a little different, I should be able to still use everything quite wonderfully. So... Let's go. Wait. And I'd say we're off to a funky start because I can't even get. All right. There we go. <laughs> All right. So, um, should I put this here? All right. Let's. I mean, because everything's going to get used. I'm not even sure everything's going to get used. Let's be honest. I'm not even sure there's space for everything but why not that's how I feel about it why not um because you know truthfully I was watching another planner video because I'm always looking for like inspiration to do some things and it really got me thinking that let's go off track and get a tad bit more creative with this planner thing we got going on. And that's what really made me think. I have all these amazing stickers to use when I put them on the page correctly. I need to get to using them. Like I'm buying stuff. And my planner um, cards are got me looking more like a hoarder than a planner, to be honest. So I'm like, I really need to tap into what I already have and really, really, really get to using things. And an idea was born. All right. Um, here we go. I'm like, I do want to put a little inspo at the top. Bam. Granted, it was definitely, I'm not even going to lie, it was definitely weird working from the bottom up, but I'm actually glad that I did, because it really, really worked out a whole lot better than I thought it would. All right, so, huh, what do we do with this now? I do want to, I think I want to put an important at the top. Oops, it goes over just a tad bit, but that's definitely my fault. All right. There we go. 
and then use this as a block bam alrighty um I'm gonna do a noted which will allow me to write in my Sunday list and my Friday list what this is really coming together and I can still use these I'm granted they're great decor but I can actually still use them um, to write down some lists as well we have our weekend adventure Oh, guess what I forgot to do? I forgot to put some washi down. <gasps> I got so excited to use stickers that I totally forgot about washi. Oh, my gosh. All right. So, not to fret because, truthfully, the only washi that is affected, I mean, the only stickers that are affected are these two. I do have some gorgeous washi to use. Oh my gosh, I totally forgot. Look, here's the washi we're using, which is why I kind of picked these colors because it works very nicely with, well, I picked the sticker page because it works very nicely with the washi that I wanted. I can't believe I forgot to use my washi. What? See what happens when you get too excited about having new things? Your mind goes to crap. All right, so let's get our washi going. Before I forget once again. Alright, let's get rid of this me. Because that is something I'm definitely not going to forget. Alright. May is out of here. Alright, so I have this um, washi that says bloom beautifully. And I'm actually just... Oh, I'm sorry, bloom gracefully. I'm just measuring it out to see as I want to get as much of the words on the page as possible. There we go. All right, so I'm cutting it really, really close. And on this side, oh, it says bloom beautifully, bloom gracefully. And I think we're just going to cut it off at the bloom. So I'm going to start at the bloom and basically work my way back. Yeah. Oh, gosh. All right. Bam. And I'm going to take this bloom off. There we go. And get out my scissors and cut this side off here. Bam. I did lose a little bit of the B, but that's okay. We know what I'm sharing. We get the point. All right. So I can put my B present back, which totally fits in perfectly. Again, if I can get my stickers on correctly which makes it evident that another sticker is crooked alright there we go okay um, I can put my important back on Bam. Alrighty. Okay, and then I'm going to frame out my weeks, I mean my days, sorry, with this super cute flowers that I totally fell in love with and had to have, to be honest. Alrighty. I really can't believe I forgot to showcase the washi. Oh my gosh. Like, I was super excited about these new stickers. Clearly. Ever so ever did.
Now, if you run into the same issue that I did where you get a little too excited, just know that it's okay. You know, play as much up too. But I will be honest. Granted, everything does mesh right with each other because, granted, I was going to stop right there anyway. But it is a tad bit easier to do the washi first, to be honest. Because your little frayed edges that you have from um, cutting the washi, that will get hidden by the sticker. So, I mean, it's not like the edges are, like, crazy frayed and you're like, oh, my gosh, frantic. But they are a tad bit on the show outside. All right. Okay. So, back to sticker love. Put my away. All right. So... Oh, I want to put that here in my weekly goal, The Good Life. Love it. Some great inspo. Um, weekend Adventure. Put that on a Saturday. Weekend Adventure. Lovely weekend banner. I love it, love it, love it. Monday. I'm going to start that off with today um I mean I want to do this here for some goals a little don't forget on my Wednesday This is the part where it gets a little funky because these don't exactly match up, but I'm using them more so as decoration to separate than actually for bullet points like they're intended, to be honest. Um, Sunday... And then I do have this nice little checklist that I'm going to add to my important. Maybe if we just move important up. Put this here first. Gracious. And then I'm going to put important right at the top of it. Like that. Bam. All right, so that's for my little Friday checklist. A couple of things that we need to make sure we get done. Bam. Now, what I can add in are these little bad boys. Right on the lines. So I can do basically my own little checklist. Let's just be honest, these things are super small, super hard to deal with because of uh, my big clumsy fingers. Or what feels like big clumsy fingers when I'm using these things. Um, Saturday. Just important to write down everything I need to do on a Saturday car wash grocery shopping <sighs> all the small little errands oh my gosh so many of them they're never ending alrighty 
And then schedule. Let's do some little inspo. This day is the day. Bam. Happy life. And last but certainly not least, busy dayhood. Okay, so here is my weekly spread in my personal planner. And I am just 100% in love with how this turned out. It looks fabulous, looks amazing. And I'm just totally floored. Like, who knew that this could be so great? Who knew? Who freaking knew this could be so great? I like it. I like it a lot. Well, here we are. We're done. Everything is completely and utterly gorgeous. And I totally, totally love it. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, definitely drop me a line down at the bottom of this video. Or you can surely um, send me an email if you're more comfortable with that. You can definitely um, hit me up on social media and slide in my DMs if that makes you happy. Because we all know we love it when somebody slides in our DMs. Um, but until then and until next time... I will definitely keep on plan on planning. So I'll see you guys later. Bye.